I dislike. Avengers Endgame 2019. I really enjoyed Infinity War, the previous Avengers movie. You know, people, a lot of people died. Are you expecting a really epic conclusion here to the Avengers Endgame? A massive war, some kind of battle with Thanos, something here. It's just Iron Man giving his life. Uh, it's just a really waste of four hours or what have you this movie is. It's drawn out. It's boring. Uh, the hype I dislike. I mean, you know, the hype to this movie following the previous Infinity War. You think it's going to be so cool and massive and epic of a war movie. It's a way to, way to end the Avengers, uh, you know. But no, it's not. It's just really a dislike of all the hype. Inception 2010. Leonardo DiCaprio here brings a lot of hype. But it's a lot of hype I dislike when you got Christopher Nolan here. Just trying to please us with a lot of eye candy. Uh, a lot of, you know, warping and movement in the film. Uh, that's all you really get. It's a lot of hype with the trailers. A lot of hype leading up to the release of the film. And the film itself. Uh, I just really dislike. I don't think it lives up to the hype at all. The movie is disappointing in so many ways. Check it out on my channel. I do go over it once or twice. Or twice. Oh, do I? Uh, but anyways, it might be a dream or an inception I'm pulling on you. But I hype. I dislike. Halloween Kills 2021. I'm a big Halloween fan. As you know, the real bit reviewer uh, leading up to this film. You come from 2018 to Halloween Kills. The trailers were plastered. Everything was hype. You see the fireman getting lifted by Myers. You think it's going to be explosive and awesome. It's really not. Uh, no one dies that should die, honestly. Don't want to spoil the movie. Don't care about it. But the hype, I so dislike how they hyped this movie and how when it came out, I just disliked it. Really, it didn't live up to the hype at all. And that's the problem here with Halloween Kills. It's a hype I dislike. Evil Dead Rise 2023. Yes, the real reviewer has a first time reaction of this movie on my channel. Check it out. Gotta make a comment on this, don't we? Uh, it's a hype I dislike. They hyped this movie so much uh, before it released. It's the best since the original Evil Dead. You know, putting that even in the same class or category. The Alvarez's remake uh, is, is just a disgrace to the Evil Dead franchise as a whole. This movie is just so boring at times um, and it doesn't make sense. The writing is shit and the effects you've seen before. Nothing new to the eye. Bringing nothing new to the horror genre. This is so much hype I dislike. Smile 2022. We're not gonna smile because we might die. I remember hearing a lot on the internet about this movie from different reviewers, different people on YouTube saying that this movie was scary, this movie was disturbing, this movie was all buff. Fuck that. It's none of those things, guys. It's so boring. I do have a review, a quick review on my channel somewhere. Can't believe I even watched this movie all the way through. I was able to do that somehow without smiling. Oh, thank I should have smiled. I would have died. Might have been a better betterment than the boredom I went through. Uh, but this hype I dislike because everyone was hyping it, talking about this film. So I dislike the smile. Nope. 2022. Nope. The hype we dislike. Uh, I dislike personally. The hype for this film with Jordan Peele coming out with another movie. You know, another M. Night Shyamalan type movie here from Jordan Peele. Another us. Another, you know, get out. Let's see what you got, Jordan. He really just airballs this here. Uh, Mr. Peele doesn't bring it. And I'm telling you, slips on the banana peel to me. Nope. It's just all hype and it's all a dislike. The hype I dislike.